Doom PS4 is not only a great movie license game, but it's also a great educational product, fun for the whole family. Not many know this, but Doom is actually a sequel to the hit Wii game, Trauma Center Second Opinion. Though this time it's a spin-off where you play as a white blood cell fighting off a red blood cell. Or however biology works. And sorry guys, I slept through that Magic School Bus episode and never saw the end of Osmosis Jones. Speaking of blood cells though, you will see several in this game. So make sure to click the button to turn off blood like in Tony Hawk to save your innocence and keep baby Jesus happy. The story goes like this. Master Chief wakes up out of the Animus after taping Assassin's Creed 38. But the Chief is pissed off after having to do the same goddamn trailing mission for like 30 hours so he's gotta take out his Ripto's rage on somebody. Which then, uh, this lady comes up on the screen. Looks pretty evil, right? You know what she's doing in that office? Shutting down Club Penguin and the Wii Shop channel. Which she's coming for you next, RuneScape. Pretty goddamn evil. Let's teach her a lesson about a lack of parental control. So we walk outside into No Man's Sky Orange Planet, but there's surprisingly more things to do than just shooting the ground and plants with a laser gun now. So you see, in this procedurally generated world, this is a universe where Game of Thrones was cancelled with one episode remaining and you are the one who happens to know the spoilers. So everybody kind of goes a little cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs on you, which uh, who can blame them? But on the other hand, they're trying to eat your face, which is a little rude, I would say, so uh, grab the shotgun. Honestly though guys, you start to feel bad for these enemies after a while. They're just looking for a friend and maybe a little bit of dinner. To avoid this feeling, I suggest naming them like the pet fish you forgot to feed at summer camp in fourth grade. Anyways, the story continues while you disembowel dude's faces in, and I'm not really sure if I just used that word right, but at this point I've just, uh, you know, committed to it and just went for it. And if not, I guess I'm, uh, doomed. <laughs> You get it? Speaking of bad writing, I checked out of the actual story if you haven't noticed. My honest recollection of this is they're on like Mars and their fuel is demon juice from hell and I shut it off because Jesus is a friend of mine. Then we go down to hell and we fight Gantu from Lilo and Stitch like 20 times. Then we go back up to Mars hell world and fight some like golems and coughing wheezing guys and uh, it's pretty hype. Honestly, it's pretty hype. Ooh, did I mention that this is literally the greatest game to just rock out and put your favorite hype Spotify playlist to? I mean, just check out the hypeness of some of the highlights I captured right at the right time. Exciting stuff. We finish our story with this Satan boss fight that doesn't really give you enough ammo, so screw this. Then you finally face off against that naked lady from before after turning into this thing. Which, uh, ew, kill it with fire. The day is saved for now. So let's get Doom Guy and Smash already, you jerk. Where does Doom go on the wall? <laughs> 